Hi everyone, this is Aaron, and today we're going to take a look at the Microsoft Arc Touch Mouse. This is our newest mouse when it comes to laptops or portables. And uh, it says Arc Touch Mouse, flexible design, touch to scroll, blue track technology, so that's a blue LED. And um, I guess we'll take a look at it. Let's see how we open this up here. So the mouse is in here, and the interesting thing is it kind of lays flat. So let's see how we open this. I guess right here. There we go. Oh, there we go. Nice packaging. A little bit of a change from uh, before. It used to be more difficult to package, so that's pretty nice. So here is the mouse itself. That's that's different. Look at that. That's kind of... Oh, okay. That's not quite as I expected, but that works. How does... Oh, okay. So it just clicks and clicks back. That's that's different. I haven't seen that before. Here's the little USB adapter. Comes with two um, let's see some two Duracell AAA batteries. Let's see what else we've got in here. Alright, so this says there we go. It says start here in a bunch of different languages. <clears throat> Insert the batteries insert the USB mouse it's showing you uh, different things now this is a little bit different in their packaging in that normally they include a disk uh, and then you install it this says to go to their website and download the the uh, optional install it's made for Windows 7 uh, right here actually is what it says it will work on it will work on Windows 7 Vista XP um, excluding Windows XP 64-bit, which is interesting. And generally, these will work on Macs as well, although I, I'll, I'll be sure to try that out. This is kind of an interesting design. So this is a scroll right here, right or uh, left-click, right-click. Let's go ahead and put the batteries in at least and check that out. Let's see if we can pull this apart here. Eh, not very easily. Let's get the knife out again. There we go. Alright, so let's get these little tiny batteries out here. Alright, so there's those. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Um, you bend to turn on. When you unbend it or put it back to normal, it shuts off. There you go. So, in the hand, Let's see. I have pretty big hands, but this feels better than the other mouse. The, the Arc is kind of in the back, and obviously I'll be doing a review on it, but it uh, feels a little bit different. This is supposed to be a touch scroll. Can you hear that? That's interesting. So it's kind of got like this false wheel sound to it. That's, that's pretty neat. Let's see if there's any storage for USB key. I guess not. So I'll be checking this out. But uh, this is a neat mouse. I, it's kind of different and something something new. I've always liked the Microsoft mouse. So if there's anything um, you want to know about it that I, you want me to recover in the uh, review that might be kind of weird or something, uh, be sure to let me know because I don't want to uh, miss out on anything that you might have specifically question-wise towards this. Um, I think it's a really nice concept. We'll see how it plays out over the next few days as I use it. So that's the uh, Microsoft Arc Touch Mouse. So uh, thanks for subscribing and commenting. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time.